Step into the flight deck of the Boeing 787 Dreamliner and you're entering one of the most advanced, comfortable and efficient cockpits ever built for a commercial jet. Designed with both cutting-edge tech and pilot-friendly features, the 787's cockpit represents a major leap forward from earlier generations. Key features of the 787 cockpit include large multifunction displays. There are five big, high-resolution 15-inch LCD screens. The layout is fully customizable, so pilots can show maps, weather, engine data, or flight info side by side. This simplified interface really reduces workload and increases situational awareness. Dual head-up displays are another standout feature. These transparent glass displays are positioned right in front of each pilot's eyes. They show speed, altitude, the flight path vector, and more, without the need to look down. So, let's talk about electronic flight bag integration. Tablets or built-in systems are now replacing those old paper charts and manuals. This new tech offers real-time weather updates, airport data, and performance calculations, making everything a lot more efficient. Next up, we have cursor control devices. They're kind of like a trackpad or mouse, but for pilots. These are used to click and interact with the displays, which is actually a first in Boeing cockpits. Moving on, let's cover advanced autopilot and fly-by-wire. This is a fully electronic flight control system, providing smooth, intelligent responses to turbulence or manual inputs. Features like auto trim, auto land, envelope protection, and reduced pilot fatigue really set it apart. Ergonomics and comfort. These are honestly designed for long haul comfort. The cockpit is spacious, with adjustable seats, armrests, and footrests, making those long hours in the air just a bit easier on the crew. There's also noise insulation and a dark cockpit design to help reduce glare and fatigue. And for those ultra long haul flights, pilot rest bunks are located just behind the cockpit. Did you know? The 787 cockpit actually shares type rating commonality with the Boeing 777. So, pilots certified on the 777 can transition to the 787 with minimal additional training, which honestly is a pretty big cost and time saver for airlines. So, behind the scenes, before every single flight, pilots actually use the 787's self-test and diagnostic tools that are built into the system just to confirm that, well, everything's in working order. Flight plans can be uploaded using a data link or a USB drive, and interestingly, some airlines even sync them via satellite uplinks. Here's a fun fact for you. The Boeing 787 was one of the first airliners to use composite materials for about half of its structure, but you know, its cockpit windows still use those traditional manual sunshades, not the fancy electrochromatic tinting you'll find in the passenger cabin. All right, quick poll. Which feature would you love to try as a pilot? Would it be the head-up display, those touchscreen-like displays with CCD, the electronic flight bag, or maybe the fly-by-wire handling? Let us know what you think. Here's a question for you. If you could sit in the left seat of a Boeing 787, what's the first thing you'd want to explore? Would it be the throttle levers, the autopilot panel, or maybe just the view through the HUD? Let's hear about your dream cockpit moment.